So Natalie and Lindsay, you're both radiation oncology residents at the Cross Cancer Institute, University of Alberta. So let me start with you, Natalie. What made you want to go into radiation oncology? I went into radiation oncology because um, I wanted to be able to, um, to help people originally when I went to med school. That was my reason why. Um, my boyfriend's father was diagnosed with lung cancer when I was, before I had started medical school. And, and he, was, he was diagnosed with stage 4. And in March 2007, he passed away. Through that whole process, when they had seen the radiation oncologist, that was always the person who was there to help offer help. Yes, we cure cancer, and yes, we're trying to reduce side effects for patients, and yes, we're trying to make sure that people live longer quality lives, and I think that it's that contribution that we're trying to make that attracted me to radiation oncology to want to have a different tomorrow for the patients who didn't have a tomorrow. So Nelson, you're a senior resident now in radiation oncology. So would you say that radiation oncology is a good specialty for a geek? Yeah, I, that's probably one of the main reasons why I selected this, uh, this specialty. I, I'm a bit of a closet geek, so this is a great specialty that lets you be, it lets you bring out that inner nerddom while still allowing you to see patients on a day-to-day -day basis so you don't get that in some of the other technology or in specialties. And I don't spend all day in a black box, which is, uh, which is probably not a bad thing. So Lindsay, why did you want to be a radiation oncologist? Well, I chose radiation oncology because I really like working in multidisciplinary teams. And cancer gives you the opportunity to work with a variety of people from uh, different medical specialties to nurses, palliative care, physios. Uh, so that's why I chose it. I like the uh, pathology of cancer and uh, the biologic processes. Uh, and I just like working with cancer patients because they're going through hard time when they come to see us and it's nice to be able to give them some options uh, and also just be there to help them through this time of their lives. But that must be very uh, rewarding for you. Oh it is, it's excellent. And you know there's a lot of um, quality of life things that happen uh, at the cancer centers. We really encourage you know art and music therapies and actually um, a lot of people come to visit us at the cancer centers and so one of the best parts about working here is that you get to see glimpses of greatness just like this on my phone. Just the other day I got to see Justin Bieber. No way. Um, where, where exactly? Well if you if you look he's kind of that the white speck there. Yeah, I see the white speck. Yeah, do you see that? Yeah. That that's Justin Bieber. Yeah, that's Justin Bieber. It's definitely Justin Bieber. Yeah, he was here. There you have it. A day at the Cross Cancer Institute.